All right, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to another episode of ASA, the series where I answer your questions. I got eight questions to answer today, so let's get started with Just Build It. And he says, ASA, I saw you recently bought all the diorama sets, which is the most overpriced in your opinion. Also, can't wait for episode 69 of ASA, LOL. Yes, that's going to be a very fun episode for sure. But to answer your question, I think I'm going to go with the Death Star Trash Compactor. I think everybody and their mom would say that. It is definitely the most overpriced out of the three dioramas. It is a really cool set. It comes with some pretty cool minifigures and it's cool how the walls can be moved for display purposes. For $90, 802 pieces just does seem kind of like a ripoff, especially because the other one comes with a thousand. Now I know that to compare the Jedi Dagobah training is kind of crazy because yeah sure it comes with a thousand pieces but most of those pieces are individual one by one green tiles or plates so it's like does that really count? Still that one was cheaper and it comes with more pieces so it feels like you're getting ripped off with the trash compactor but I do like all three of the dioramas. I just, I think that the trash compactor is definitely the one that's overpriced. And I think everyone's going to agree with me on that. Next question is from EK Starlord. And he says, have you ever watched a Daredevil TV show? If not, I would highly recommend it. It's pretty awesome. Yes, I have actually seen Daredevil back when it was on Netflix. Now it's on Disney+. Plus. I also agree with EK Starlord. If you've never seen it, you should watch it. But now it's on Disney+. Plus. Next question is from CF Productions. And he says, ASA, are you going to watch Dr. Sh strange yes i am because i've already seen it and it was a pretty cool movie i'm not going to spoil anything here so don't worry it was a pretty cool movie i liked it. it had a lot of great cgi and whatnot the story was engaging and cool so it was a, it was a decent movie i shouldn't say like it was amazing like i think i'd give it like a 7 out of 10 i would recommend going and seeing it though if you're a marvel fan because it was cool next question is from hershey animations and he says why in the world do you like potatoes so much i answered this in the last video so I guess you weren't listening, so go back and watch that one again because I'm not answering it again. For starters, just look at them. They're absolutely amazing. Look how cool and awesome potatoes are. Like, how do you not like potatoes? Next question is from Trixel, and he says, ASA, what are your thoughts on Sonic Fronier's? I, I think I said that right. Ha! No. You stupid. And will you be using it for background gameplay? Probably not. I've never actually touched a single Sonic game in my entire life, so probably not. Next question is from the Zavrak Bricks, and he says, ASA, what is your favorite animal? So I actually love pretty much all animals, but if I had to pick one, I think I would go with foxes, at least right now, because that just sounds like the best to me. So I just love foxes. I mean, just like, how can you not look at a fox and think they're adorable? I'm pretty sure they would rip your face off if they got mad at you, but they do look absolutely beautiful and amazing and adorable so yes next question is from ek starlord and he says which of these star wars movies would you want to see made darth sidious a star wars story 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 i can't read or a darth vader star wars story that's a really tough one because they both sound really cool but in a kind of sort of way we've already seen darth vader's story right like with the movies and rogue one and like you know darth vader becomes or anakin i mean becomes darth vader right so you kind of already know his story so i think darth sidious it'd be cool to see like palpatine like as a boy being trained by darth plagueis and all that crap like that'd be kind of cool and then seeing him kill Darth Plagueis in his sleep. Did you ever hear the tragedy of Darth Plagueis the Wise? That'd be pretty cool. So like, it would be cool in my opinion to see a Darth Sidious movie or TV series or something. So I'm gonna vote for Darth Sidious. That was a weird voice crack. And our last question is from Ace Gamer Studios and he says, ASA, there is going to be a new Star Wars anthology series called Tales of the Jedi. What stories would you like to see in the series? Honestly, I haven't even heard about this. So first of all, thank you for bringing this to my attention. Um, second of all, I don't really know. I guess just anything would be kind of cool. It'd be kind of cool to see like how the Jedi, uh, assuming this is like when they first like became Jedi, it'd be cool to see like them discovering things like the Force. Obviously, I'm more into the Sith and whatnot. I guess the first thing I would vote for if I had to pick would be seeing the very first person that gets corrupted by the dark side and what happens with that. So that'd be kind of cool. So I have no idea what this is going to be about if I'm even right. Like if it's kind of like Old Republic or something. So. 
so we'll find out i i don't know enough about this so i probably sound like an idiot here but yes so that's the fun part about asa making me sound like an idiot right yep. anyways that's gonna do it for today's episode of asa so thank you all very much for watching thank you for your questions make sure you leave a like on this video if you enjoyed it helps out a lot shows youtube that people want to actually watch my videos and of course ask a question or two for the next episode and i will pin my favorite to the top which means you get to go first so yes have a wonderful day and i will see you guys next time